Hey everybody and welcome back to Machinarium. In the last episode we met our hero's girlfriend um, and she helped us um, get up here to the greenhouse and I'm going to try to remember this as best as I possibly can. But we are going to grab this stick first and we're going to move this beam item over to the right and over here is a control panel and if you guys have ever played the game flow on um, like an iOS device then you kind of understand the concept of this it gets harder than this but you have to solve the same exact puzzle a few times um, there we go. And you just keep going. So, I may fast forward this. But you guys at least know where I've started on each puzzle. <clears throat> There we go. That's three down. Um, oh my goodness. I've actually played, um, I think it's called Flow anyway. This isn't uh, the same Flow by the people who made, um, I think it's another game company or not another game company. Something like that. Um, the ones who made Journey. It's not that flow. It's a little more, I don't know, a little more simple, I guess. <laughs> but it's kind of the same concept. It's not too hard if you know what to do and where to place everything. And now we are on the last one. And hopefully I get this right. don't know okay good yeah this puzzle isn't that difficult especially if you watch this and now we hit this button and it causes those um, victory bell looking things I don't even know I don't know what they're they're called technically I know they're, they're not Venus flytraps because they're kind of like bell plants. But what you want to do is you want to stick that stick in its mouth so that it doesn't chomp your arm. And now you have a magnifying glass. And we will use that later, actually. So now you want to push... Whoops. You want to push this here. Or no, no, no. You want to push this over to the empty one. I'm pretty sure. Oh, whoops. I pushed it too far. I'm silly. I'm so silly. Okay. And you want to put this in there. Run all back to your little control station. And zap this as well. And they have a nice little sunflower plant that you're going to want to shake. And there you go. Now you have sunflower seeds, which is so far, I believe, the only edible thing that he has put into his mouth. But in order to get out, um, down here is another control panel. Uh, it is another code-based control panel. Um, there is a butterfly flying around. And you're going to want to... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Pay attention to its wing pattern. So there's one in both far corners of the wing. And then there's three kind of uh, together 
on the inside. So this is the pattern that we are going to use to unlock the door. You will see once you see the um, the pattern of the code here. There we go. So we have one up here, one down here, one up here, one down here, and then these three. And then you pull his little tail, and the door should open for you. How about that? All right. So now, um, I believe I'm going to do this part of the video in the next episode. Um, actually, no, I'm not. I will do it here. Screw that. <laughs> I will put the sunflower seeds up here. And um, trust me on this, you do not want to pump that little pump um, before you place the little canister down here because otherwise you will have to shake the sunflower again and grab more sunflower seeds because your sunflower oil will be wasted and you're gonna have to manually pump this yourself and once that is full you're gonna grab it and go up and we're not going to deal with this guy um, just yet. Instead, we are going to slide down this. Hot down, buddy. There we go. And we are going to give him his sunflower oil. <laughs> and he is a much happier camper than he was before we're going to pick up his bandage and this here is an arcade ticket i'm going to go ahead and head that way just so you guys know where to go um before the next video but it is up here uh we have been here before this is where the cat was and we electrocuted the cat um, but the arcade is in this room here, and we're going to get to that in the next episode. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this playthrough um, thus far, and I will catch you all next time. See you then.